Alright, welcome back, folks, to our Aludra playthrough. It's brought to us by Shadow. Thank you for supporting the channel. And uh, last time we played, we, uh, we were doing the optional dungeons. We found the Ace Rod and the Fire Rod. And now we're going to try and find the last area, which was actually supplied by a Spy Shadow. <laughs> So hopefully uh, I can't, I don't miss the directions here and go in the, in the opposite way. Hopefully. Then again, I wouldn't be surprised. First off, we're going to go see the lady. Wait. Yes. So the reason why we talk to her is because she's game facts and also uh, we also get our health back. Grand facts. Lady of the facts. Hey, isn't that where we need to go? Save someone from a huge current. Mm. All right. Yeah, yeah. I know all about my quest. And so we're off. We ram into a tree. Equip our ring because it gives us more power. Oops. Not that we really need to give her full health, but still. Gotcha. Well, let's drop a bomb on this fella. the wall. Go back to town, I'm sorry. You missed it. Missed like five minutes of it. No ugh for you. Now, I don't know, is this King Snow? Okay. <clears throat> so from King Snow, I need to go... What? Yes. I need to go in there. Supposedly. And then I need to go in there, supposedly. We did it! We found the optional dungeon. Completely on our own, of course, with no help whatsoever. Too spooky so far. What? Oh, -ho! pretty sneaky game, but we can't really do anything about that, can we? Mm. 
don't think we've used the ice wand. Well, it's the same thing, same animation, except it's blue. Kinda lame game. Kinda lame. Oh, we can charge? Oh, yeah. If I can drown in here. Water dungeon. It's gonna be like uh, Sonic. So do I have to... Have to jump? Like, where does that go? That's very hard to gauge. This is gonna be awful. I can... I can already imagine this. Optional dungeon was the worst dungeon, and I fell for it hook, line, and sinker. Now I'm trapped underwater. I can't, I can't do it. Water, my only weakness. go from here, right? Oh! Tricked again! I guess I gotta fall on the opposite side. I don't think the bomb's gonna save us. Go. 
one on no. There we go. That's I'm falling through. Yeah. So, well, I mean, ice dungeons, water dungeons, water temples, you know. You know how they are. I don't need to explain this, right? Exactly. Timing, right? We go. What? So I have to go to the right, right? I thought I could slip through, but guess not. Optional dungeon? Yeah. It's, um, uh, it's, it's pretty fun so far. I'm, I'm drowning in the fun here. Fun <laughs> is optional. He ain't wrong. Okay. Oh. 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 Am I here? Well, to suffer, obviously. It's freaking... I don't know where to go. I can't break the rocks. Unless I gotta ride the bubble. So it goes higher than where the rocks are. Tried going right with the bubble, it didn't work. I've seen the solution. Yeah. I need Brelix's permission. Well, Brelix, if you don't want to get banned, you better give permission. Shall we call you Banlix now? Oh, I can, I can make it one shot. 
Oh, what do you know? I don't even wait. Don't even need the bubble. Okay. What if I need? I just need to hit this. No. those pillars. Ah, uh, maybe. Maybe I need to push them towards the... No. No. It don't matter. Maybe I just need to make ice. Oh, this is it then. This is the next two hours. Hope you guys are happy. Oh, you probably are. You probably are. Goodbye, mining bomb. Goodbye. Like, the logical thing would be to go down, but I can't go across the, the rock. Probably gonna be like a pixel jump. See that pillar? Can you get to it? Yeah, we can get to that. I mean, I can get to it right now if I wanted to. By doing that. There is an option you haven't considered. An option you have not considered. Maybe... That gives nothing- no, it gives everything. You just don't get it. Don't get it, man. Oh, that didn't help me at all. Double balloons. Bubbles. Okay. Oh. Well, not the right option. You don't say. You don't say. No. 
No problem, luck. At least you're trying to help. Unlike some people. It's an option you've done before. I guess so. Oh, didn't do that before. Beans worked. That's how you know I'm in trouble, right? Squares. What the hell does that even mean? Think squares? Oh. Well, it doesn't help, but... try Doesn't seem right. Yeah, but th does that even help us? Bubble there. 
What does think squares even mean? You're just trying to mess with me. Wouldn't be the first time. It might be a fake mic. I think uh, there's a high possibility of that happening. Shouldn't you be in bed by now, Mike? problem. kind of sad. Pretty ironic that we find the secrets, <laughs> the secrets of the bugs in every playthrough. twice as well. So how's everyone doing tonight? got light back in my neighborhood? Oh, something happened. Dead. I think this is the first time I die. Take a minute and I'll be right back.
right, sorry, I had to get uh, game facts open there. Real quick. A lot of places in the city got flooded. Jeez. Okay, so this time, let's do this right. Let's not get stuck on uh, a sprite. This time, at Shadow said nothing. Said I'll give you a real hint later, and you never did. Was the real hint to get stuck in a sprite? Because I did that, it didn't work. Was you push a boulder to crush boulders. How do I push a boulder though? push boulders but kind of don't want to get pushed or other secret rooms along the way are you gonna dress up for cosplay glitchathon glitchthon glitchcon get it I don't know what glitchcon is The answer is, you're here to- ah, uh, okay. I see. So... Give a special thanks to Shadow for wasting everyone's time. <coughs> G- 
Jesus Christ. Get out of here. Never walked on this tile out of all the times you passed it. Well, we didn't pass it that much, though. Like, this is the second time we're here. Ooh. Mikey Balls. Boys, mission accomplished. Yeah, this is gonna drain the water. Oh, there goes the rocks. There we go. We know lizards are weak to ice ones. This time, for sure. I don't know about being a lich, you know, the whole not having skin and all kind of 
Kind of freaky. Like, I'm not really vain, but, you know, having, having skin is, like, pretty good. Imagine being stuck on that puzzle. Yeah. Well, we got mostly stuck on, you know, Pixel. Stuck indeed. Oh, I know where to go. <laughs> the bubble. No. So, what's my plan, though? plan well it's fairly obvious when you that we did it we finally did it Solve the water mystery. What do you mean, halfway there? I'm done, right? Eh? You can't. 
carrying too many herbs. Yeah, just a bit, right? be a herb. It is! Wouldn't herbs be ruined underwater? I'm no herbologist, but... started. We'll do it like before. To be fair, I didn't really need to do that. <laughs> oh, animation. Stenia. <clears throat> I am one I am at once amazed and proud that you have progressed this far, releaser. I am Stenia, Queen of the Waters. Your action has been shown to my heart by the rivers and oceans. Over the course of human history, there have been many gods. Not long ago, there was a race of giant gods called the Gazek. You have met one of them, Nirud. The Gazek was car the Gazek were carved from stone by hands of ancient humans. The seven Gazek were revered and feared by the ancients. Soon their prayers gave life to the Gazeks. They literally became what humans believe to be. They literally became what humans believe them to be, but the Gazeks did not want to share the power of human prayer. They fought each other for it. They killed each other for the prize of human adulation. All but one of them perished. Only Nerud declined to fight his fellow gods. He watched with a heavy heart as his brothers slaughtered one another. But when the killing subsided, Nerud found that he was a god no more. <clears throat> I 
The ancient humans had long since lost faith in the warring Gazek, and a god cannot exist without faith of others. Without the faith of others. Soon another god was born from the prayers of the people, and that one was Melzes. But he was not the god of eternal peace, for which the humans had prayed. He was even more flawed than the Gazex had become, using fear to gain the faith of humans. But Melzus feared the wisdom of humans. He knew that they could strip him of power. Therefore, he began slaying whomever seemed to threaten his existence. Somehow you have managed to escape his machinations to this point. Huh? No, Rox! Melzus has been watching us, Alundra. He has used my own water against me. Take this, Alundra. Melzus will soon destroy this place. Leave here, Alundra. You must hurry. The destruction comes. <gasps> Fiend Blade! Where's friend blade? That's the most important one. Time to escape. They don't say. Things are getting a bit dicey. You may notice the rocks fall. The what? Rocks falling. I don't see it. Hey there, Hover. How's it going? No. Friendship lost. Friendship lost. For, for friendship lost. Octolutus. Right. Well, obviously I know who Lutus is. I mean, it'd be pretty silly not to remember, right? That's Ludus. Mm -hmm. Queen of the Facts, save me. Two to the left. 
Isn't that where the uh, king sword is? evil boy I say Ludus is looking for where is Ludus I am also looking for this Ludus Several weeks ago, Ludus and I were walking near the coal mine, and a huge boulder! Ludus... Ronan appeared out of nowhere and shoved Ludus out of the way, saving his life. Ronan may be praying to... Ronan might be praying to the gods, but he wouldn't destroy this village. We must look elsewhere for the true source of this evil scourge. Oh? Was Ronin a good guy all along? Ugh. This kid. Fucking mad trash. Why aren't I drinking today? Why don't you shut up before I get so angry I need a drink? Damn. What about this lady? The gods are there. The gods are here. The gods are everywhere. The gods are inside of you. The gods are inside of me. And they will slay me. I thirst for life. And I beg for death. Please. Please help me. Help me! Help, Alundra. I haven't, uh... Having some problems, lady. I don't think I'm... I don't think I have the solutions for you. Dude, is there anything I can do to help you? Surf is the most heinous, and I've totally run out of things to talk about with my way cool pop. Still don't understand why the gods have claimed so many of our young ones and left me here to develop bunions and hemorrhoids. <laughs> oh. You know, there's a thing called too much information, old man. You just crossed that line. Oh, there's Ludus. Oh, Lindra, I'm looking all over the village for you. Listen, there's something I need to ask you. My life has been in danger several times recently. Once I was about to get smashed by a boulder, Ronan appeared at the last minute. 
you and Septimus must have discussed this. You think Ronan has something to do with my being placed in danger in the first place? Yes, you're right. It's more than some coincidence. But why did Ronan save my life after putting me in harm's way? It's a good question. I didn't jump, that was the game. I'm sorry, Lyndra, but I heard what you were saying and I have to ask. I don't understand why Ronan saved Ludus's life, but I have a feeling you do. So Sybil's dream told you that if Ludus died, his spirit would return as the Holy Sword. Which means Ronan saved Ludus to prevent you from obtaining the sword. But how could he know about Sybil's dream? I think Sybil would tell Ronan something like that. Wait, did we pray to Melzus? Uh oh. To pray is to allow the gods into your mind. No. Let's go to the sanctuary and destroy the statue. Let's go. But what about the thing that was drowning in the water? Oh well, probably not important. Probably not important. Let's go s smash the state. Gentlemen first. Oh. Ronin, we're here to smash the statue. Well, well, Alindra, I see you're with Maya today. The statue of Melzus is hidden in the basement of this sanctuary. I can feel it even standing here. Oh? The gods have shown themselves to you, have they? We've seen you! We've seen you in front of the statue! What... How do we not know this? You've seen anything at all. It is a devil, not a god. You want me to take you to the statue I keep, not to worship it, but to destroy it. How does he know? You underestimate me. You are likely to be severely disappointed, children. Understood, Ronan. Now get out of my way. Please don't try to prevent the inevitable. Arrogant girl. Beaumont has always known of the statue in my sanctuary. Everyone knows, and not only... And they not only approve of it, dear child, they pray to it as well. <gasps> How would they react, I wonder, if you were to destroy the object of their fervored supplication? I'd wager the reaction to be much less favorable than you would hope, little ones. Be that as it may, this is not over, Ronan. Not even close. I will prove to everyone that the statue is the source of evil, and I... And it will be destroyed. Those words of blasphemy shall return to consume you, heretic. <laughs> Ronan is the murderer, I'm sure of it. 
What's more, I believe the next target is someone else near you. We must try, we must strive to protect the rest of your friends before he strikes again. I will stay with Septimus. You must, you must watch Jess. We better hurry. Darkness will soon shroud the village. I'll meet you at your house tomorrow. Hey Jess, I'm here to protect you. Alindra, you should get some rest. You look tired, you know what I'm saying? Oh, I definitely know. Always running around from one place to another. You deserve to relax for one night, my friend. What? Me? I cannot sleep yet. I have much work to do. People living, they can't sleep. You know? You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna go to bed at 2 p.m. We're not depressed. What are you doing, Jess? 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 Just do it. Alundra dreams of what Ronan said as he left the sanctuary, but his exhausted body eventually overcomes his anxious mind. Alundra gently sinks into a deeper slumber, and then, all too soon, the moon and stars surrender the heavens to the morning sun as a cock crows in the distance. <laughs> wake up, Alundra! Wake up! It's Jess, he... <gasps> Jess... Breathe, breathe not the foul air of this evil world any longer. <gasps> no. People of the village have gone to the graveyard. Come with me, Alindra. Jess. No. Suicide. Two, two bullets to the back of the head. He made the amateur mistake trusting himself. It's ogre. Now who's gonna craft our items? For an adventure game, we spend a lot of time in the graveyard.
How come we didn't bring flowers? It's kind of, you know. Out of all the people, we should bring flowers. Yeah, that's true. It ain't right. Ronan, it's you. It was you. Jess found you on the verge of death and nursed you back to health. And how do you repay his kindness, Alindra? You kill him. Yes, Alundra. I lay the blame for Jess's passing solely on to you, murderer. How we were sleeping. We were taking big, uh, big nap. Big Z's. Alundra, I... Here, take this key, Alundra. I found it clinched clenched in Jess's hands. I have no doubt that his last wish would have been for you to have this. If you need anything, Alundra, anything at all, I'll gladly help you. All you need to ha all you have to do is ask. Time to open the small chest. Ah. Receive Jess's diary. Alundra. You know what I'm saying? If you're reading this, I must have expired. Oi! This is not good. You know what I'm saying? Oh, Jess. Even... Even dead. You never cease to make us laugh. Beyond the Veil. I went to see what Ronan was doing at the graveyard while you were sleeping. I know you are suspicious of him, and so was I. But I did not want you to take him on alone. I'm very scared, Alundra. My hand quivers as I write. I must resist the urge to crumple this note and throw it away. It would be easy. It would be so easy to forget about Ronan, walk upstairs, and retire. But I cannot do that, my boy. I, I consider you my son. And I do not want you to be ashamed of me. Oh, um, okay. So I have summoned all the courage I have remaining to write this letter. Before I go to Ronan, Alundra, after my wife and son died, I was a broken man. Your iron will and light demeanor has have fixed me. I do not know you. I did not know you for long, but I'm glad that I did. Thank you, Alundra, my dear son. Love, Jess. Inside the box is some kind of battered, broken armor. Received the broken armor. Broken like our spirit. You are awake. This is progress. This is good. I was afraid you might be having an eternal rest. You know what I'm saying? My name is Jess. I'm a swordsmith. No big whoop. What's your name? Alundra. Pleased to meet your acquaintance, Alundra. You were on board the Clark? You're lucky. You know what I'm saying? If they have not found a piece of that ship bigger than my fist. Now we're go going back into the past, remembering the good times with Jess. Remember the good times when he was alive. This 
special diary. Remember when Jess made a bomb for us? Wait, what? And then we went to Bomb Turtles. Yeah, that's... I remember that. My boy! Gotta regain my passion, you know what I'm saying? True words. The Mining Bomb. Just too dangerous. But I'll give you the bomb, though. I go to the mine, I see if it's safe, and maybe I'll let you go inside. You stay here. I'm gonna keep you alive. I remember when we were both alive. I was worried. I'm just happy you're safe and sound. Are we gonna go through every event with Jess? Might take a while. Oh no. The most horrific day... <laughs> the most horrific day in Alendra's life was finally at an end. As he closed his eyes, he could still see Jess's... Gentle smile. As this image faded, Alundra silently wept bitter tears of shame and regret. However, even the potent tears fade, failed to wash away the pain from his heart as he implored the gods to stop the madness. He tumbled into restless slumber and asked, We've made a, few, a foolish mistake. We prayed. Ugh. It's not the same. It just ain't the same. Lundra, I need you. It's my daughter, Elen. Has collapsed! Please, Elendra, I beg you. Use your powers to save my daughter. I swear to you, I'll change my ways. But if she dies before I've been away too long already just to fetch you, I must return to her now. Please come, Elendra. I'm begging you. You hop down the chimney. Which one? This one? This one? Lurvies. That was a lurvy.
Cliffs of Despair. Wasn't that to the right? Spare Desert, well... Close. The Cliffs of Madness? down the chimney? up twice. How does he keep doing it? guy seen a lot of things boy well that's a new one on me uh-huh was the door too hard to open mm-hmm I guess you figured out what I do here uh-huh go around town and collect garbage fix it then I sell it ain't proud of that fact and I'd appreciate it if you didn't tell nobody See, and I just got right in the head. Tell you what, you need something fixed, bring it on in. I'll make it right for free. Get back in the story, a wisecracking city dweller. I want you to repair my armor. I reckon I got to keep your secrets too. Uh-huh, I do. Just leave this to me. Just 
It's going nuts. Been a long time since I banged an Been a long time since I banged armor. Did a damn fine job too. Uh-huh, I did. Pretty, ain't it? Makes me proud. Ancient armor. <coughs> it's true, Rusty, that's very true. Anything else? See ya. So, who's gonna make the magic sword if Jess is dead? Is there no. Is there no way to win? Is it all over? would create wouldn't fix them all right I have no idea where the guy is so might take a while to oh there it is hey yeah why she she should already be in the house The nightmares themselves grow stronger. The gods, cruel, heartless. Just would make a mining sword. You're not wrong. Oh, it's it's purple lady. Alan has multiple personalities. I counted four of them. Her nightmare will be incredibly complicated to conquer successfully. She can't destroy the nightmare alone. I'll quit drinking. I'll pour every bottle of booze in this house. Just help my daughter. Please save her. I'll do it. doesn't deserve this I can't possibly defeat this nightmare Alindra I don't even think you can destroy it by yourself will you let me help you will you help me sure let's go I know we can do this together in fact together I believe we can conquer almost anything <sighs> You, you gotta be cautious. If you die in the dream, you die for real. Going to the Matrix. can help you. Oh no. 
Donkey Kongs here. from how is it going? What? Perspective, am I right? It's a uh, clock, so... Hades four hours a day for the last two weeks. How's the, uh, how do you like the game? Played a bit, but I kind of stopped. <laughs> Not that the game is bad, I just didn't have the time. I didn't take the time. I'm stumped. Don't worry. I'm coming. Forty hours. Dang. Okay. Any ideas how we're supposed to open the door? Ah! Jump on her head. I can't believe I let you use me for a stairmaster. But I must admit, you were great. A freaking stairmaster? Really? I don't think I'm missing out on the herb. No. Okay. Wait, I have an idea. Okay. Did it. This this tag team friendship.
I miss something? Ah, this is where we need to go. This is new. Waterfall. Too many herbs. This timed It'd be pretty obnoxious if it was. Far too wide to jump. All right, Stairmaster. Told you I'd give you a head start. We're doing puns now. Tell me it's up. There we go. We're down. Okay, don't have to tell it twice. It wasn't funny the first time. The key. begins geometry we've got to destroy all four of the nightmares jeez if one remains I'm afraid Ellen is doomed to perish horribly uh, what do you want to start with go with blue Platforming.
How fast do I have to go? Maybe not have pixel perfect jumps constantly in the game. That'd be nice. Is this mandatory? I could go without a life vessel, I don't mind. I think I can make that jump. I have to go around.
anything away from the portal. Was this a nightmare? Because it felt like it. <laughs> All right, so this is going to turn off. I know you will, game. Cool, okay. So it was wrong. Get it. It's time for Donkey Kong. triangle yet.
Oh. What? You're late, Alindra. What's the matter? Gonna let a girl best you? Help me release the trap in this room. We have to push the left and right switches simultaneously. Let's get to it. Jeez, pretty fast. Wonder what we're gonna fight. Uh oh. It's a girl! Oh, hello. It's been so very long since I've had visitors. By all means, come in and die! <gasps> no! Oh, it's two slime lords! Gelatinoids! I see. I wonder if... faster. How am I supposed to deal with two gelatinoids? What is this game? I've really entered the Kaizo levels. Gelatinoid! My fess, my fess, my face pressed on the slime. Jellin? Not anymore. The hidden eye has been overcome. He's done it, folks.
get your mind out of the gutter there. Perhaps my mind was in the gutter. Stage number two. Oh, no, no. I thought I was, I was out and they pulled me back in. Life vessel's not gonna save me now. Oh, there's holes as well. No. Oh. What? What? want to push these oh boy highly mobile units nice I should fall yeah We have evil dream music, evil nightmare music. No, I think it's fitting. I don't know. What do you guys think? Tentacle monsters, well, I mean, who doesn't, you know? All I need to do... Yeah. Okay, let's switch number two. The other switch. Uh, I, I press all the switches? Unless the switch is reset. Nah, they wouldn't do that, would they? Wait. 
wait, what? How does this even work? I don't even know what I'm supposed to do here. Like, I'm not even kidding. I don't understand this puzzle. this puzzle but okay maybe you got to drop the ice things down nope Get it. Go through the pushable pillar yeah but here's the problem like how do I push this there there is no pushable pillar there What? That makes 
That makes no sense. Like, I can't push the pillars into the hole. So, like, I don't know what to do here. You know what I'm saying? technically get out of here either. Only one. And I can't reach it. So... goes down. There's still high jumps though. Not like it's easy peasy. What a horrible night to have a curse. Ah, never mind. We're still cursed. Thank you. 
seem to get up there. get out of here though I swear I really didn't take you for the type that treated women like doormats. Oh, sorry, I gotta do it again. You're not wrong there. Not wrong there. Ronair has been a bad influence. Bad influencer. did it have to be a pillar puzzle it had to be an ice pillar puzzle you poor little things i'm sorry you came thank you thank you ellen but no not gelatinoid again Gotta fight him on ice. Not very nice. I mean, fighting too wasn't that bad though. I can assure you fighting on ice is pretty awful. Yeah, that's true. Two on ice would be... It would be Alindra. Did it. Get out of here, gelatinoid. Hidden Eye is not actually his real name. The Pact of Fire has been broken. I wonder... That was a 
bad move. Yeah. I noticed after. Connected then. All right, I think we'll call it there for tonight. The brain's fried. Already, yeah, well, we've been twenty minutes overtime. So that'll be it for me for tonight. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Special thanks once again to Shadow for supporting the channel. And we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.